Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal. Now to our lesson, we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. Right, hello, boys and girls. Welcome to Heroes Modern School Academy. My name is Mr. Leanne. We are going to be talking about fourth grade mathematics with number six and day number five. For the content may be found on page number six to seven of your workbook if you've got your workbook over there if not you're welcome just to turn and watch with me on the board the content is going to be there in front of you as well so today we're going to be talking about fractions of numbers fractions of numbers what do i mean by that i want to give you a whole number and tell you to find me a fraction of a whole number and for the past couple of days, we've been talking about multiplications, right? So you're going to use the, your knowledge and your understanding of multiplications to find fractions of whole numbers. That's what we're going to do in this class today. All right, so let's try to get started with it. All right, so let's use this example to understand what we're talking about. So, for example, this example says over here there are 42 students in a class. So, the classroom has 42 students over there, boys and girls. Two-thirds are boys. How many boys are in the class? So, you're going to say 2 divided by 3 multiplied by C, which is 2 divided by 3 times 42. 3 over here, 1, 3 here is 14, so that's going to be equivalent to 28 boys. Okay, so there are 28 boys in the class. Now, how many girls are, girls are in the class? So if there are 42 students in total, the number of boys are 28, so girls will be 42 minus 28, which is 42, 28, 4, and 14. Okay, so there are 14 girls in the class, okay? So that's how you can use your knowledge of multiplication to find fractions of whole numbers, two-thirds of 42. That's what we just did in this example over here. What fraction of the classroom are girls? All right, well, we can prove that by saying, well, 14 divided by the total number 42. Well, what fraction will be girls? That's just 14 divided by 42 over there. Well, we can reduce this fraction a little bit for, further to have four, two divided by four, that is seven. Two here is 24. So that is seven divided by 24. All right, so that is how you can find fractions of numbers right there all right i want to thank you for joining me today remember god cares about you and so do we till next time bye, -bye. i'll be your hero's body and as you study with heroes born you